Uh, my name is Clifton Smith. Uh, from Fresno, California. Went to Fresno State. Cali boy for life. I'm a running back and returner. Uh, was in Tampa Bay for two years. Pro Bowl returner in 2009. Last year I spent the spent the first first few weeks out in Miami with the Miami Dolphins, and I've spent the last few games with the with the Cleveland Browns. So, what, what, what's your adjustment going to be like then to Virginia? Where you know I'm a you know I'm one of those guys that it's not hard for me to get adjusted. You know I I go out and I I enjoy meeting new people and having good conversation with people. So. You know, for me, I don't think it'd be too much for me to, to get out and be a, get adjusted to Virginia. How did you get here in particular? I know you told us a little bit about, you know, um, your days in the NFL and that you were a Pro Bowl, um, you were a Pro Bowl returner. So uh, how did you how did you get here and, you know, what, what are your goals while you're here? Spent the first few years in Tampa. Um, you know, things didn't work out there. So it kind of, you know, I bounced around during the league last year. Then. With the whole NFL NFL lockout going on, I just got tired of playing the waiting game, the waiting game to see what was going to happen. So I just felt like, you know, this is my opportunity to come back out, show the NFL teams that I can still play, um, you know, that I still got it. And, you know, to come to, come to uh, this team, you know, I looked at the roster. It, we got a, a lot of great talent out here. So, you know, a lot of guys that want a lot of guys want to get back to the NFL and play, you know, play on Sundays. So. You know, for for us, we're just all out here competing, having fun, having a good time at this. You know, and you know, building a building, building a family here. How do you feel about like having Schottenheimer as that person to lead, like you know, this this team in order to help a lot of these guys get back to where they want to go? You know, I, you know, I think I think coach is gonna do a great job. You know, as long as everybody leaves the ego at the door, you know, and uh, pay attention to all everything that he's teaching us. I think he, he'll do a great job of getting us where we need to go, getting to the highest level, getting back to playing on Sundays. Just like he said, you're going to, just like he told us last night, set, set your level up to the expectations all the way to the highest goal. And once you, hopefully you, you can get there by you keep working hard. All right. So how have people so far, you know, family, friends, reacted to you joining this team? And then how have you seen this community so far from the time you've been here? You know, my family and friends, they, they're real excited for me to come out here, you know, to come out and play again because they know that this is, you know, playing football is, is what I grew up wanting to do. So, you know, I've, I've had a lot of support from family and friends and, you know, the community out here. I've been, I've been stuck in this hotel for the last few days, so I really haven't had a chance to get out much. But, you know, as far as the, the guys on the team, you know, I've, I've We've already we've already built built some great friendships going on. So my, my roommate Pat White, great guy. Uh, you know we we talk all the time. So it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a great team. Pressure up the middle. Kenna gets it away. Wadley kick comes from their side, taking it to 16 by Smith to the 20. Cuts through one man still on his feet. Drops back 25. He's 30. 35. Smith to the 40. Oh, Cuts baby. it through midfield. Cuts back to the near side. 45. We also know that you have a couple of nicknames. You know that you go by. Uh, right, right. Uh, let us know those nicknames and then. Tell us what you prefer to go by here for the Destroyers fan to call you, for them to make their signs, for them to get their jerseys. You know, um, back in California, everybody knows me as Batman. Um, you know, that's I, my thing is Batman is the only person that he he doesn't have any superpowers. He's just all human, all hard work and de determination, and that's how I live my life. Just all hard, hard work and determination to get where you got to go. The people in Tampa, they know me as Peanut. Uh, but when I first got there, some guys started call, calling me pork chop just because I was the smallest guy on the team. And then my special teams coach, Rich Basachi, changed my name to Peanut just because I was the smallest guy on the team. So people out there know me as Peanut in Tampa. People out here in Virginia, you know, I leave that up to them. Whatever name they want to call me, whatever name they want to give me, you know, I'm up to suggestions. I'm up to choices. So they just let me know. I'll pick it then.